hey guys what's good how you doing welcome to the channel if you are new to this channel and if you are please consider subscribing thank you very much indeed for stopping by thank you very much indeed for clicking this is hp laser mfp 135w this printer is multifunctional printer it's multi-tax triple and one if you like in the sense you can copy scan and print from this gear this printer is using 109 sorry 106 a toner 106a toner this printer is dual band you can connect it via wi-fi and also via usb cable which i'm going to connect right now i'm going to show you some of the features from this printer then we'll go from there and connect this printer right at the back here at the back here this is the power cable for this printer it goes in right here Okay, and this is the USB cable. We have the USB cable at Vinetex store. So the USB cable, you go in straight, push it in. Okay, and this flash section will go to the PC. Okay, so I'm going to turn this printer around. This printer is very compact. It doesn't take a lot of space. Okay, so it's built with the space to have enough space in mind. Okay, right now, I also want to show you some of the features from this printer here is the scanner you stick your document on top of the scanner and it will do the job okay so here is the scanner from the scanner we loaded the paper tray it's using various sizes of paper a4 b5 4x6 so you just need to adjust the paper you are using right you turn this printer on and off from right here this is the on and off button this is for you to select the function you want okay and you are ready to go okay this is for you to cancel if you select a job and change your mind you press cancel this button here is for you to when you want to copy for you to increase for you to increase the number of the document you want to copy you press this and the number will change from inside for you to go back you press this okay and press ok right this is wi-fi light this button here is to scan this button here is for you to increase the quality of the document increase the quality of the document you want to copy or scan okay right now i also want to show you the toner okay leave this printer up i'm going to drink water excuse me So once you leave this printer up, right? You bring this out, open it up, okay? And to change the toner, you bring it out this way, pull it, okay? Here is the toner. If you check my video, you see how we loaded the toner, right? There's an arrow here, you need to go in straight, okay? Follow the, the line here, like a bridge, you need to make sure you set it right in the middle and you are ready to go you hear a click sound once you hear a click sound you know that this is within the settings okay so you close this down okay and once you close it down you just pull it down as well you can see this printer is right now it's connected to wi-fi i want to show you this printer is connected this blue light is for wi-fi network okay i want us to connect this printer without wi-fi so i'm going to press it if this light is flashing intermittently, it means it's not connected, but once you connect it to the Wi-Fi, it will be steady on, okay? So I'm just gonna press it now. And once you press, it will ask you Wi-Fi is on and off. So if you select this, use this arrow, okay, to, to turn it off. Okay, so use this arrow to select Wi-Fi is on. Okay, select okay. Right now, if you want to use this off, okay, you can see, off and on so right now I'm, I'm gonna turn it off click ok ok it's disconnected you can see there's no light here the wi-fi is not on ok if you want to turn it back on ok you just need to do the same thing ok use this arrow wi-fi ok select ok now it asks you on and off ok then press this ok and select ok and 
it will come back on okay in case if you want after a few minutes after a few minutes it will connect you see it's connected okay right now and once it's connected it's there so i want to turn this switch this wi-fi off okay switch it off for us to disconnect it and once it's disconnected there's no light here so for i want us to connect this printer via basically via usb cable connection okay right now this end of the usb cable okay is connected to the printer so what we need to do is basically okay what we need to do is select click this in push it in here we go setting up device okay setting up device and once you connect this to the wi-fi network it will ask you to set up device okay well here we go it's telling us device is ready okay device is ready once it doesn't take a lot of time it's telling you device is ready but what i want us to do is basically actually go for the app and look for this printer so okay it's telling us right now device is ready it's connected via usb cable connection okay the next thing we need to do is go to hp smart app okay and look for this printer okay here is the app okay select hp smart app Here we go. Once you select, it will tell you connect HP Laser Jet MFP 135W straight away is there. It doesn't take a lot of time, just you need to connect it from the printer and connect this section to the printer. You are ready to go. Okay. If you want to scan a document, okay, you stick the document you want to scan to the scanner. Okay. So I have a book here, I want us to try scan this document stick it on top of the scanner okay the next thing you need to do from the app right you see get supply scan shortcut printable print document print photo okay printer setting select print select scan And once you select scan, you just need to wait. Now it's telling us scanning is unavailable. You go back. select scan here we go it's ready it's, it's now available okay initially you need to wait for this to dictate okay so you select the put the document on top of the scanner okay you can select preview once you select preview it will fetch the document you want to scan okay here is the document scanned here is the document scan so if you're happy with it then you go ahead and click scan if you want to change anything you you change okay right now if you there's anything you want to do like the document is document if it's photo then you select photo but it's document then you select document okay entire scan area okay if it's letter then you select letter if it's a4 you select a4 if we, if it's four by six or five by seven you select the particular paper you have here right okay what we have here is a4 paper okay or you can select entire if you select entire surface area then okay then you, you can also select the color 
but this document you even if you select color it will scan its color but it will print out black because it's lesser okay then after that then is resolution you can increase the resolution the maximum resolution is 300 dpi so you can select 150 or 75 dpi so right now it's 300 dpi the next you need to do is click scan Here we go this is the document scan okay so right now here's the document scan if you want to print it out okay or want to save it or share if you want to click share you select share okay and it give you the option for you to share through email okay or one not one so select email right now this document is going to my inbox so if you want you just need to type the email address of the person you want to send it to which I want to send it back to myself. Okay. I want to send it back to myself. This document will. So what I'm trying to do is to send this back to myself. Okay. So that for us to re receive this document. So you type the email of address or the person you want to send this to okay so right now i type the, my email address the next thing you need to do is click send okay right now is this document is sending this document is sent to my inbox okay the right thing i want us to do if you want to save it you click from the your pc click save once you click save then you go to the file you you see save as so you select the particular place you want to save this Okay, you can save it at document file or or picture. So you select it at particular place you want, or even save it at your desktop. So I'm going to save it at picture, right? Then it's and it give you today's. Here we go. This document just landed in my inbox. It just landed right now. Okay, and the next thing you need to do is you can save this document for anything you want. Okay, any name you like. Okay, and click save. So I save it with anything. So once you click save, okay, our job right now is finished with this section. You click OK. Okay. If you want to print it out, this document will scan. You select print. Okay. Once you select print, right, you need to make sure you go to the particular printer. From what we have here, from this PC, I have M Canon MG3600. So you need to make sure you select the particular printer. What well, this printer will be lesser jet okay so i'm gonna tell you it's lesser jets mfp 131 okay lesser 131 series okay so you select the particular one okay 131 133 135 series okay the next thing you need to do is click send okay if there's anything you need to adjust portrait okay or landscape the paper document is A4. If it's A3, then you select A3. Okay. So if it's C5 envelope C4, you select the particular document. So it's A4. Okay. Then full page. Okay. Then layout. One photo per page. Okay. If it's multiple page, then you select multiple page. Okay. Then the next thing you need to do is print. Now it's telling us the printer is off. Okay, so the printer is off. I need to go back and make sure we selected the particular one. Okay, because we... so what we need to do right now, I want us to okay go to the inbox and see the document we send. Okay, here's the document we send. Okay, click it open. This is the document we scan. Okay, click print and select this particular printer we have right here we need to look for here we go we tell you the other one was off because it's Wi-Fi HP lesser MP 131 133 135 138 it's ready we we'll tell you okay click click on it and also click print 
okay if it's double-sided if you want to print this double-sided print on both sides you can actually select it from here from the inside okay right now click print here we go this document is right now printing out here we go this document will scan send it to my send it to my inbox printed it out okay here is the original one okay so guys this is how to connect this printer via usb cable once you connect this printer to usb cable straight away it will recognize your printer and tell you that you are ready to go give it a few minutes for the system to pick up to recognize the 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 scanner okay once you recognize the scanner you are ready to scan print and copy okay if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe it helps us to grow Thank you.